Hello everyone, this is Jack from Dr. Prius app again. Um, this is a 2012 Prius C with the stock nickel metal hydrate battery. Um, so I'm going to swap it out with the Nexel DC in, uh, in a few hours. But just before that, I would like to test how much of the EV range uh, this car can deliver. So let me just uh, charge out the battery using the like this dependency Step test. One, Good, it's already fully charged. So let's go ahead and start the test. Let me push on the EV button now. Cool. And we are at the exact same location as last time we test the previous Gen 2. Uh, so nothing special. Let's see how far you can go. Um, okay, trip computer. Oh, <laughs> the engine already kicked in. Yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, by the way, I just test this battery, the life expectancy test before doing this. Uh, this battery has 75% of the uh, capacity left, so it's in good condition. Okay, taking out the battery is the easiest part. Uh, first thing, you have to take out the trim over here. There are a couple of clips, one, two, three, four, five. Second, you have to pull up the seat. So, once you pull out the seat, you explode the uh, 12 volt battery as well as the uh, high voltage battery, probably four, four to five volts, and you are good to go. Right now, it's the hard part. The hard part is actually, uh, I would say it's not that hard. It's just a lot of bolts that you need to uh, unbolt over here. Um, so it's a good thing that you have a, a power drill. And I'm going to go through the process with you. While you're waiting for the battery blade to cool down, it's a super good idea to just clean out the fan itself. So take a look at the fan. This car is 2012 Prius C. Uh, it has around 80,000 miles on the clock. And it's it's okay, but see all the dirt is going to block the airflow. So we, we're going to vacuum it. Also, take out the retaining uh, plastic clip over here. You can take it out. Look at the blade. Look at the situation. In this case, not too bad. I don't see a lot of deposit over there, so we should be good on that side. Just need to clean out the surface. millimeter bolts holding in place 
uh, at the bottom, so we will have to take it out right now. A little bit of corrosion here and there, so we're gonna clean up. The uh, battery is nice and cool now. It's at less than 80 degrees, so uh, I think it's good to do the swap. Uh, before we tearing apart, uh, take a look at this part. So uh, this is the service plug, right? Um, and take a note at the blades that's on the service plug. This would be the place that you put in the spatial blade. Um, the spatial blade is the the one with terminal on both sides. See this one? It has terminal on this side and here side. So this will be the one put in here. Therefore, you take a piece of tape, all right, and mark it. Just mark it over here. And you're good to go. The lithium prototype is now secure on the cradle here. Um, so now it's the time to reverse the order and put it on the harness back in. Uh, and as you can see from the uh, from here, there's only one side with per terminal because most of the terminal, uh, most of the blade are internal connected. Therefore, there's only one special blade that has the uh, the the service plug connected. Okay. Forget to secure the uh, service plug as well. Never ever over torque it. Hand tight. Good to go.
and this is done. I do not secure the blade from the bottom, so you see a lot of leftover. Uh, basically, this is a prototype, so I'm going to run some tests and take it apart again. All right now, let's put it back to the car and do some tests. Now we have everything back in the car, um, everything is connected, double check, triple check. The only thing left is the 12 volt battery is not connected yet. So before you put in the front and the seat back, connect the 12 volt battery, put the service plug back on, start the car, make sure there's no error code, everything is fine. Then put the rest of the, uh, the accessory back in. Okay, moment of truth. Good. And looking good. Now we can put back the uh, the friend, the seat, as well as the plastic cover. To finish the job. All right, let's run some tests with this baby. All right, we are at the same place uh, with the leasing battery. Let's do an EV range test. Trip computer reset. Zero mile. So see at 41, 42%, almost done. Engine kick in. We are at 2.5 miles. So that's the result. Thank you for watching.